All of the tests so far have been conducted in almost ideal conditions with a steady light steam load. However, in reality, steam demand is rarely steady. It comes in peaks and troughs, and the boiler must be able to respond to these changes. Whenever the steam demand increases, it will take a little time for the boiler to realize its output to match the new demand. However, during this transition period, more steam is being used by the plant than the boiler is producing, so the total amount of steam in the system falls, which causes the pressure in the system to drop. Falling pressure has a major effect inside the boiler. Watch as the steam demand is temporarily increased, but within the boiler's maximum output capability. The bubbling water surface begins to rise with surprising speed, and within a few seconds, the level is so high that water and foam are being drawn into the steam takeoff. As soon as a high demand moderates, the pressure rises and the surface level quickly returns as normal operations re establish. This sudden response, often referred to as swell, is a result of two compounding factors. One, the steam bubbles within the main boiler water expand under the reduced pressure, causing the surface level to rise. And two, at the same time, water flashes the steam, resulting in more turbulence. Flash steam occurs whenever there is a lowering of pressure. If you had a vessel containing high pressure water just below its boiling point and opened a valve to lower the pressure, some of the water would spontaneously change to steam without any heat being supplied. Closing the valve would enable the pressure to build up and the flashing would stop, but there would obviously be less water left in the vessel. The temporary formation of flash steam is a normal mechanism in which a boiler copes with an increase in demand, but it's important to realize that steam demand should be increased gradually, because it's the rate of increase that causes a boiler to become unstable, even if the high demand is well within the boiler's output range. 